Hello, my name is Alan. I'm from Sober Lab, and uh, this will be my first video in English. So uh, get ready because this channel will start to show different options to do your home lab. So what it's pending for you to start it's you. So you should start it as soon as possible. And with these videos, I will start to explain something about the hardware that you can choose and what options that you have either for budget option as well for more expensive options. The softwares that we're gonna use for as a basic program and others programs that you can use in the top of it to emulate different situations. Some, some of the videos will be quite basic and a lot of those will be why you want to show it or why you want to teach about it. All the reason it's because will be a progressive steps. All these programs that I'm showing it's because in the future I will try to come back and show what's the option that you have. As well, some of the programs, it's uh, interesting to have a multiple choice because one of those is not the best one that suits your needs or you don't like the template or you don't like for any reason something and this reason, it's interesting to do. As I commented before, uh, I will be showing some videos based on Raspberry Pi and uh, based on computer. I don't have a proper server, I wish to have in the future, but at the moment I have uh, one old uh, desktop. Maybe I could use a NAS server, look like Synology or QNP or others options for a NAS server. But uh, the idea is to start with the things that I have in home and with it I can upgrade and look what I really fit for my needs. Most of the times I don't want to spend unnecessary money without really know if I need that uh, hardware and if it will be usable for me. This reason I start with the basics and I start to improve time by time. I believe that uh, this one will be the suggestion for you. If you didn't start to do your NAS server and you look for it, this is the time to start and you should start now. Because for you to start now, you don't need anything else. You don't need a big component, you don't need a big hack with a lots of servers, a lots of uh, switches and continue on. You need basically an old computer or something that you can start. Uh, my first server, I start with an old dual core that is built in 2009 and work for quite a while and most of the application work well. And that I get my old computer that I use as a computer and put as my old server. You don't need to spend a lot of money and you don't need for a start a really powerful computer. What you need is a small and a simple computer with some hard drives and that after this one, you start to look your needs and upgrade it. And through these videos, I will start to show different options that you can look for different hard drives and why you should look for these hard drives and the reason of it, different CPUs that you can use, different runs and the quantity of runs that's interesting to do it, some power supplies and the system that we're gonna use. But uh, the first one that they're gonna start will be the Open Media Val, where I will start to show some programs based on Docker. It's one application that uh, you can do a lot of visualization for different images. Most of my videos will be based on Linux, where it's the open source and you don't need to spend any money for a start with these programs, different for a Windows server or anything else. I prefer the Linux because it's open source and as well you can see the code and that you can feel more safe that uh, will be open for you to understand what's going on. So in the next videos, I will start to explain a little bit more for the hardware and some software that you can install to make your system more user-friendly. So some application will be really basic that I will show and will things that is not necessary for them show it. But in the continue of the other videos, you're gonna understand why I show it and the necessity that you have that program pre-installed before install the next step. So what depends for you to start, it's you. So. Now it's the time and follow my next video. See you soon.